it's fantastic, you know, people can just walk in off the street, come and enjoy, come and meet some great, fantastic athletes like Sally. And yourself. <laughs> you know, it's good, it's a great atmosphere, nice and relaxed and fun. It's lovely to come along and to hear how many people have been coming through and uh, I just think it just seems fun. It's lovely that people can just come in and can spend an hour and there's so much for them to do and that, that's brilliant. Well, if I think if I'd got in there and uh, had a try at everything that's going on, I've had, well, I did have a go at the handball. I certainly wouldn't have been a handball, so it probably would be the sprinting. But with this body at the moment, I'm not sure that would even do very well. <laughs> uh, I think I personally fancy a go at the handball, so maybe yeah, race Sally at the sprint and she can beat me in that and I'll have a go at Sally on the handball. <laughs> we'll take it in turns. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't realise with the time zone just how many people have, uh, have worn Mizuno over the years and, uh, you know, it's great to be one of those people that, that are there and uh, to be up there with so many famous people as well. When I was looking at the time, time zone, I was actually looking at how good the shoes were even back then. <laughs> so, yeah, it's actually really um, educational. I think the best thing about the Mizuna Performance Centre is just how people can come along, they can sit around, watch and actually physically have a go at some of the different sports, you know, actually hold some of the shoes and equipment and, uh, you know, I don't think there's any other place that you can do that at the moment.